Hi, my name's David King. I'm a Gundungra man from the Blue Mountains, New South Wales, Australia. I'd like to acknowledge my elders past and present who've looked after this country, this land, for thousands of years. Cared for it, managed it, and kept it strong. Today I'm just going to talk a little bit about this country here, which I love, that my mum, who was born on Gadumba clan country, the Gargaree, the Gully Katoomba, my grandfather from the Baragarang clan, the Yukal Warragamba, Warragamba Dam, that they looked after and walked on. This is sort of my opinion. This is my heart. Not everybody might support me on this. But I think as people, we've got to make choices. We've got to look at our country and realise how unique it is. We've got to stand together for the flora and fauna and above that for each other. You know, traditionally, we worked with our land, with the sounds, the smells, this beautiful flora behind me. So much bush tucker, so much strength. So many animals sleeping peacefully right now, waiting for nightfall. So many different elements that stay strong due to the fact of how our beautiful creation works. So I personally think that we need to make choices that keep country strong. Bringing in more noise, more pollution, destroying the peace and quiet of what we as Australians enjoy. Sydney's unique. It has a national park on each boundary. People come up here to see this beauty. And if we keep on making decisions that take away that peace, that take away that strength, that take away this beautiful country, then it's to the detriment of all of us. But it'll make us sick. Our health will start to deteriorate. Why don't we make choices where we enhance our connections, where we walk on country, where we spend more time in peaceful and quiet areas, where we sit in beautiful bush like this? I love the smell of these gums. These gums were used to welcome people onto country, to sit together in peace and quiet, to look at the stars at night, to sit in the daytime, to hear the sounds of the birds, to see the animals move. When you bring more noise pollution, when you bring more air pollution, the animals and the plants start to deteriorate. They move away. I hope, as Australians, we can make that choice not to commercialise this airport. I hope we realise, together, that the more we can bring sustainable environmental tourism, personal connections, sitting down with each other across these mountains in peace and quiet, enjoying mist like this, enjoying bush tucker plants. There's so much bush tucker around here. We're not far from where right now we might not be able to do this because of the noise, because of the smell. So I hope we all make a choice. Thank you.